What's up, babe? You got home safe or what? Hey, baby, what's up? Yeah, I got in a few minutes ago. I was just about to make myself something to eat. You know, um, can't wait till we can hang out together and coming home, both of us. Um, I just love it. And, you know, you know that I'm always worried about you, always worried about what could happen to you and I wouldn't forgive myself if, if something happens to you. So, um, I'm sorry, but I'm like that and I love you so much. Uh, just a question. So, have you talked to your roommate about uh, you moving out with me? I haven't gone around to it. He's always busy. I can't remember the last time we had a decent conversation, though. Whenever he is around, though, he's a little shit. He's always pulling some scary shit on me. Wait, 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 wait. What do you mean? By, what do you mean by that? Like the other day, I got home super late from that because I was working on that exhibition that I told you about at my job. And I walk in the door and the lights don't turn off. And I was just like, what the fuck? So I headed to the maintenance closet on our floor and Bren was in there and scared the shit out of me. Really, Jennifer? <laughs> this is great. So you have a 30 something year old man acting like a 10 year old. 10 year old kid so who does that this is incredible i can't believe this <laughs> i mean he's a decent guy i wouldn't go to that extent why haven't i met him still then because when i met him i never saw him in real you know in real time so i want to talk to him i want to i want to know how he looks like and um i don't know Like I said, he's busy a lot of the time. When we talk, I bring you up, though. Uh, all right, all right, all right, all right. No, no worries, okay? So, no worries about that. Just finish whatever you're doing right now, and and then, if you can, so just send me send me some picture of, of everything what you're eating right now, and or you're gonna eat after, because I wanna rate your cooking abilities, you know? So, forget the other thing. It's not worth it, you know? I love you so much and I just wanna see you happy and yeah. All right, don't forget to send me your pics. <laughs> sure, I'll send you pics in a bit. That's weird. Okay, I don't hey, wait, know how up? to even explain this, but I think my apartment's haunted. Oh, oh, wait, 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 what's wrong? 
No, so I just sent you the pics that I took of my food, right? Well, I thought it'd be cute to send pics of me eating my food. Uh, I looked at them and I swear there's something in the photos and it's a weird ghost looking thing. Okay, okay. Hold on, hold on. Mm, baby, I know you love the paranormal, but I think you should start, you know, cutting off all of these ghost hunting YouTube channels. Uh, it's for your mind safety. Carl, I swear to God, I took pictures in different rooms. The thing in the photos won't go away. I'll send you them myself. Did you check your lenses? I mean, the phone lenses? And ensure, I mean, yes. it's just to ensure that there's no any type of stain on the on the lenses and... Okay, I mean, because there should be an explanation about that. You know, uh, I don't know. Do you know if Brandon perhaps could be playing any prank or something like that? How would he do that? He's not even home. Okay, well, then call him. I want to talk to him about his jokes. So this is not, this is impossible. This shouldn't be happening, you know, right? I really don't think it's him. Call He's him, call not him, call home. Him. Right now. <sighs> okay. Nothing. I'll text him. I'll see. Maybe he'll respond to me then. Okay. <clears throat> so, no worries. Just let's calm down and just relax. I'm sure it's nothing. So, look. I think I think you had you had a long day so perhaps it's because you're stressed out and you, you just need to to relax yourself and you know uh, take a rest uh, I don't know set an appointment tomorrow for for some some massage or something like that um, you just st stress out so just calm down and, and and release all the stress that you have go around tomorrow do something because you're so sad, babe. Okay, yeah, yeah, you're right. I'm just gonna sleep early tonight and forget about it. I'm sorry for worrying you. That's okay, that's okay. It's totally fine. Uh, <laughs> but you know, there's something that I love so much about this call. That I was the first one that you call. And when something happens, when there's some problems in your life, you just aren't afraid to to call your knight in shining armor. So that's what I love so much. <laughs> Thanks, babe. Call you tomorrow. Bye. I'm not, I'm not losing my mind. Not losing my mind. Hey, hey, what's up? Brandon, are you home? No, I just got to what work. What time did you get home last night? Why, what's up? Oh, that's weird. I 
woke up in the middle of the night to pee and I thought I saw your light on. Are you sure you didn't stop by our place last night? I actually didn't come home yet. I spent the night at a friend's house. I was trying to reach you while you were out because some weird shit was happening when I was on the phone with Carl. I mean, why would I lie to you? What's the matter? I took a few pics of myself eating my dinner and sent it to Carl and we both saw this weird ghostly figure in the back. What happened? Look, I know it sounds crazy, but have you noticed anything weird since you moved in? Are you spooked or something? Okay, forget I said I anything. I was just playing. I'll pay attention now. Can you send me the pictures if you still have them? Yeah, sure. These are very nice pictures, Jen. Well? But no ghost. What? There's... There's no way. Carl also saw the shadow in my picture. What the fuck happened? Did you mess okay, with my okay. camera or something? Okay. Relax. Did you move my clothes to the couch? <laughs> Come on. Explain to me how would I do that? Okay. When you're always you know what? Phone. I'll just see you later. I'm going to be late for work. Come on. I wouldn't mess with your stuff like that. Hi baby, guess what I'm doing? Hey baby, what's up? I'm so jealous. Yeah, you wish. Yes, I do. Nothing. Um, do you remember the picture from the other day? Ah. I know, but wait, I just want to get second, something baby. sorted out. Like what? Well, I spoke to Brandon to see if he had anything to do with it. Okay. But I thought that uh, we agreed that it was something, something wrong with the camera, so... I, I don't know why you're keeping this. I know, I just, I thought it wouldn't really? hurt to show him. The weird thing is, he didn't see it because it was completely gone from the pictures. <sighs> Here we go again. Okay. It could be in that your phone was glitching, so... We agree in this, baby. Come on. I mean, I don't know, I feel like more weird things are happening morning after we talked, I was getting ready for work and I left my clothes in my bed, right? But when I got out of the shower, they weren't there anymore. I found them on the couch. Baby, perhaps you moved them into the couch. Don't you think I would have remembered? I didn't put them there. Look at you. You're still on break. Uh, I don't know. Perhaps you're, you're going through something, you know, um, you have a lot on your plate right now and that's the reason why you're on break. I really don't think so. I have a bad feeling about this apartment. And what about Brandon? Do you think he had something to do with this? No, he wasn't here when all of it was happening. Are you sure? I know. I know you said that he pulled some crazy shit on you to freak you out, so... Yeah, but I don't I think he'd go far everything. to really mess with my head. Besides, he was out of the apartment both times I tried to talk to him. Maybe... maybe I should talk to him, you know, uh, because he just sounds so creepy and sketchy, so... <laughs> if you want to talk to him so bad, I'm pretty sure he's around. Brandon, can you come here for a sec? One second. Brandon? He's gone off again. <laughs> This is so hilarious. Every time I want to talk to him, he's never he's never home. So, 
I thought I heard him walking earlier today. I don't know today. what happened to this guy. Jenny, you need to make it a point. The next time that when he's around, so I get an introduce. Because I need to make sure this guy is not a creep. I told you already he's not like that. You need to stop being jealous. Look, babe, I'm just worried about you. That's it. And you look exhausted. So, you've been sleeping or... Alright, I have enough time off to catch up on sleep. And I think I should go out there and spend some time with you. It's okay, I'm fine. Just need to get some rest is all. Look, baby, I'm sorry if I... I'm making you feel that I'm overstepping here, but I just want you to be safe. And I love you for that, but don't get ahead of yourself about Brandon. I'm okay. I'll get some much needed sleep this weekend and I will be back to normal. All right, get some rest, baby. I'll check in you later. All right? Love you. Bye. Brandon, can you lower the volume, please? Brandon. Senate last probably about 40. We're just a lot more healthier as a family in general. Ever leak your clothes in the dryer and find a wrinkled mess? Brandon, are you home? Try down the Wrinkle Guard fabric softener. Wrinkle Guard penetrates deep into fibers, leaving clothes so... People worldwide have already got chipped, and the trend seems to be broken. Brandon, this isn't funny. You can't, you can't be doing this. Oh my god, baby, the apartment. Hey, babe. What? What is it? Are you okay? The TV and then the lights. Oh my god. But what? What's happening? Slow down and catch your breath. Something is wrong with this apartment. I told you, I was, I was, I was trying to take a nap, and the TV turned on, and I thought Brandon came home, but I didn't, and I didn't notice. But he's not here, and then someone rang the doorbell, but no one was there. And then what? the lights kept, kept flickering, and then the TV started. It just kept turning on and off, and, and switching on their own. And where's the fucking Brandon now? I don't know. I ran out of the apartment so fast. And did you call him? No, I was I was focused on getting the fuck out of there. The son of a Stop, bitch. stop. It's 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 not it's not just a prank. I, I just I need to leave this apartment. There's something not right about this place. It doesn't it doesn't feel safe anymore. Okay, this is enough. I'm fucking booking a flight and heading over. Stay away from that apartment. I'm booking I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna book a room and a hotel down the street until I can find another place. I'll I'll talk to Brandon about it and 
and tell him I can't stay any longer. Okay, baby. I'll get a trip sorted out and I'll call you I'll call you back, all right? Okay. Thank you for this. Well, I'll see I'll see you soon. Hold on. What happened? I, I was alone earlier when the TV started just changing channels on its own and the lights were flickering like crazy. And then someone was ringing the doorbell, but no one was there. And then I just, I freaked and I ran out. The doorbell could have been anybody. Even some kids playing in the hallway. Now the TV and the lights going off and on, that's concerning. I've never experienced anything like that when I'm home. I mean, it seems you're never home when these things happen. Hey, I know you have a lot on your plate right now. Maybe you're just going through a rough time and just seeing things. Do you hear yourself? I'm not, I'm not losing my mind. I'm, I'm Listen, moving out ASAP. Just wait for me to get back and we'll talk face to face. Everything will be all right. Fine. I, I just checked into a hotel down the street and... Please be quick. I, I don't want to stay there any longer than I have to. Okay. I'll see you in a bit. Baby, I just yeah, found baby, out someone had been murdered in my apartment the month before I moved in, and, and no one's lived there since. Why would my neighbor tell me that? Wait, what? Come on. How? Let me get there first, and we'll find another, no, another place. No, something's really off about Brandon. I told you. What about him? I just... I find it odd that when Brandon's not home, there's this this paranormal activity. And also we had a conversation about his marriage and he can't remember why his wife, his wife left him. And I, I don't know if this entity is malicious or just trying to get my attention, but I, I feel like I, I can't rest until I find out. And I'm ending my break and going into work tomorrow. But, um, I, I need you to see if you can look into anything that might discuss the murder that happened. Apparently, Brandon had no clue there was even a murder. Okay, that's really fucking weird. I'll see what I can find.
A jealous woman murders her husband after two gunshots on his head. She argues that it was an accident and that she loves him so much, but he's dead. The victim was identified as Brandon Villa. That's my roommate, Brandon. He's been dead all this time? <laughs>